all know our next person on the show as the outspoken, witty, and spoiled younger sister on We Channel's Braxton Family Values. Take a look, take a look. Is this still naked? Don't you feel naked? Like something's missing? It's the champagne. I think so. Everybody knows that champagne goes with, you know, planning a wedding and going to get your wedding dress. That's like the best part of looking for the dress. They're supposed to get you drunk and buy a dress that's completely out of your price range. Duh. <laughs> Please welcome friends of the show, Tamar Braxton. <laughs> more that you give on the show. And, and congratulations on Braxton Family Values. Uh, you know, it was a smash hit the first season, and now here you are wrapping up your second season. Yeah. And I did the reunion over the weekend, so Tamar and I just saw one another. Um, and will we, in this, uh, in the, at, by the end of the season, finally see Evelyn, your mother, get married? Well, I do have to say, you have to watch, but I know that if there was a wedding, I didn't go. Oh. By the way, what's up with your solo career? Um, I am working on my album. I finally signed my paperwork again. Yes. When, when is the CD coming out? Uh, my single's coming out in the summer. Is it? No, no, what, what type of music is it? It's popping. <laughs> it really is. It really is. Jamming. Well, we saw you perform at the Soul Train Music yeah. Awards. Did you get good feedback? Yeah, I think I did. I mean, you know, my fans really like the way, you know, I perform and they, you know, like, yeah. Yeah. You did a good job. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. I'm, aren't we so not used to seeing Tamar have a regular conversation? Really? Yeah. I mean, <laughs> I mean, all of this. Oh, you got it good. <laughs> Who wouldn't want all of this? I mean. I want to acknowledge Vince, Tamar's husband, is here. Vince, everybody, as you know, was recently treated for blood clot to his lungs. So how, how are you doing? I'm doing great. I'm doing really good. Yeah. We're here for his three-month checkup. For his three-month checkup. Yeah. Yeah, you got really emotional when he was in the hospital, and as well you should have, but we saw a sign of you, uh, a side of you on the show that we don't normally get a chance. Yeah. This girl right here wasn't there. <laughs> it was all about, you know, this one, that you, yeah. the one that you are right now. Very, very calm. Oh, am I calm? Right now? Oh. Yeah! Oh! <laughs> people, um, people think that you're too hard on Vince. Do you, do you get what? that? Do you get that feedback? <laughs> I know no, you read the blog. I get, I get the this is too hard on me sometimes. Really? What? Are you kidding me? I'm hard on him? Well, you know, it's a lot because he's my manager too. Yes. So, you know, it's kind of hard to cut off, you know, when it's time to kick it and when it's time to work. Right. Because I'm always thinking about it. So I'm like, so why did you do that? And what are we doing this? And yes. why is that happening? So it's not like I'm tripping out. These are like general managerial questions. I right. Because you're, you're married to your manager yeah. and it's very difficult. He also is very busy with Lady Gaga. Yeah. And, and yeah. Mindless and everybody. Mindless and everybody. So you've got to get in where you fit in. I mean, hey, you know, <laughs> use my time wisely. Mary J. Blige was here about yeah. a month ago, and Mary talked about how you all were great friends. As a yeah. matter of fact, she did mention that the night, it was the night that the four of you were supposed to be going out on a double date. Yeah. And Vince got sick that night. Oh, it was so hard, you know, and I have to say, she and Kendra were really there for us. Um, it was it was the worst thing that you can ever possibly imagine. I didn't know what was going to happen. It went from let's go to dinner to he's in intensive care to call your family and friends. Wow. Just like that. that how did you meet Mary? How did you forge such a personal friendship? Uh, Vince and Ken have been friends for years. Uh -huh. And you know, naturally, like when your husband is friends with somebody, you go out to dinner. Uh -huh. and we hit it off right away. And now we're like BFFs. So much fun. <laughs> Mary's a nice woman. She is. She's a good girl. So, what's the official big news? Well, Vincent and I oh, here she goes. have snapped our own reality show. <laughs> when does it? I want.
details. Uh, yes. Where is it going to be shot? Is it going to be shot in L.A.? and following you in the studio? And, and uh, go. It's shot mostly in L.A., um, but it's going to be about me being an executive wife and the other side of me that, you know, I guess you just saw a little glimpse of. Right. Like me being a businesswoman and me venturing out into my own business and then managing it and us bumping heads a lot. A lot. <laughs> I love that. When does it start? Um, it starts next month. They start shooting next month. Well, I can't wait. Tamar, thanks so much Thank for being you so here. Thank you so much, my love. And you guys check out Braxton Family Values Thursday nights at 9 on We. Up next, the very funny Mike Epps is here. <laughs>